I voted for you for captain, Audrey. Thanks, Catalion. I voted for me too, since I'm pitcher. I think pitcher should always be captain. And besides, if I wasn't captain, then Francine would be captain. And she's awful bossy. Don't you think she's bossy, Catalion? Gee, Audrey, you're kind of bossy too, you know. No, I'm not. And anyway, I'm gonna be a great captain. And my pitching's getting better, too. My dad took me out after dinner last night, and he says I'm improving. And we're going to have a terrific team. But we don't have enough kids. I know. So I asked Arthur to play. Arthur? Yeah. And he's coming by in a few minutes to sign up. Arthur? Yeah. He's a good friend, and he really likes baseball. Arthur can't play baseball. Why not? Won't his mom let him play? No, I mean, Arthur's not good at baseball. Really? I never played baseball with him. Catalion, kids like Arthur are never good baseball players. What do you mean, kids like Arthur? Do you mean kids who are fun to be with can't play baseball? No, I mean... You mean kids who have rock collections? No, I mean... You mean kids who live on Claremont Street? No, I mean... Kids who look like Arthur can't be good baseball players. Oh, why not? I knew a kid who looked like Arthur once, and he was a terrible baseball player. Then I heard of another kid who looked like Arthur, and he was even worse than worse. And then my favorite cousin Richie, who's almost a grown-up, he says that kids who look like Arthur are never good at baseball. So that's how I know. Jeez. I know it's complicated, Catalion. Probably kids who look like you don't know about things like that. I mean, remember yesterday when you didn't know? Gee, Audrey, I thought it was my mind that had to do with knowing things, not what I look like. Besides, I know lots of stuff, even stuff that you don't know, like, hey, here comes Arthur. Oh, hi, Audrey. Hi, Catline. Hi, Arthur. Hi, Arthur. Audrey, did Catline tell you that I'm going to be on a baseball team? Um, Arthur, are you sure you want to play baseball? Yeah, my sister and I play all of the time. But, Arthur, you're not good at baseball. I'm not? Of course not. Kids who look like you are never good at baseball. Right, Catalion? Maybe you're good at some other sport, like gymnastics, but not baseball. But I play with my cousins all of the time, and they think I'm a pretty good baseball player. Are you sure you were playing baseball? Maybe it was soccer or something. Well, I got to go practice my pitching. Hey, Catalion. Want to come catch some balls for me? Sure, Audrey. Gee, Arthur, I didn't know you couldn't play baseball. Well, have fun doing gymnastics. Maybe it was soccer. It wasn't soccer. It was baseball with a bat and bases and a ball. I'm a good enough baseball player, and when I grow up, I'm going to be great. And the score is tied in the World Series battle between them and us. Batting for us, the greatest hitter of all time, Arthur the Cool. At the mound, pitching for them is the rough, the tough, 
In fact, the meanest pitcher ever, Archie. Two strikes, bases loaded. This is a tense moment, folks. Here's the pitch. He swings. It's going, going, gone! That ball is a home run! Arthur. Arthur. Arthur, what are you doing? I'm hitting a home run. Without a bat? Now that's impressive. Mr. Kim, do you think I'm a good baseball player? I've never seen you play, but I don't see any reason why you couldn't be. But I heard that kids who look like me can't be good baseball players. Come away from the mirror for a minute, Arthur. I'm having a lot of trouble understanding what you're talking about. But Mr. Kim, I thought people who look like you are supposed to be smart. You see, Whoa, I heard that... something very strange is happening here. What I look like doesn't have anything to do with whether I'm smart or not. Yes, it does. What I look like has to do with whether I'm good at baseball. Audrey says the kids that look like me are not good at baseball. Hmm. Audrey must be pretty mixed up. You can't tell what people are good at or bad at just because they look a certain way. That's stereotyping. What type of typing? Stereotyping. Thinking that all people who look alike have the same color skin or are the same religion are the same. That they're all good at the same things or bad at the same things. So, does that mean I'm good at baseball? Well, it means that no one can tell what kind of baseball player you'll be just by looking at you. But Audrey said she didn't want me to be on the team. And she's the captain. She may be the captain, but she's not in charge. In this school, anyone who wants to play baseball can be on the team. And I'm hoping you're going to play with us. Well, I did want to play, but Audrey was really mean. It makes me so mad. I should have known that Audrey was mean because all kids who look like her are mean. I, wait a minute. Is that what you call it typing? Mm-hmm, stereotyping. But you have a reason to be mad. Audrey has no way of knowing what kind of baseball player you'll be until she sees you play. She must have really hurt your feelings, huh? Who hurt whose feelings? You hurt my feelings, and I'm mad. I did? You are? Yeah. Mr. Kim says that I can too play baseball. But Mr. Kim, kids who look like Arthur aren't good at baseball. Audrey, what makes you say something like that? I mean, it hurts Arthur's feelings, and it's not true. But Besides, at this school, anyone can be on the baseball team, even if you haven't learned a lot about playing yet. I knew a kid who looked like Arthur once, and he was a terrible baseball player. Then I heard of another kid who looked like Arthur, and he was a terrible baseball player. So, Arthur must be a terrible baseball player. That's logic. No, that's whatchamacallit typing. Who said anything about typing? <laughs> Stereotyping, thinking that all people who look a certain way are alike, or that they have the same talents or abilities or faults. You mean Arthur is a good baseball player? I don't know whether Arthur is a good baseball player or not, but I do know that I can't tell just by looking at him. I also know that if we don't let him play, he'll never be a good player. Arthur needs to practice and learn to play baseball, just like you're learning to pitch. My favorite cousin, Richie, who's almost a grown-up, says that kids who look like Arthur can never be good at baseball. Audrey, I don't know your cousin, Richie, but he's got some strange ideas. What if I said that everyone who looked like you is a terrible pitcher? And then supposing I don't even let you try to pitch? But, but that wouldn't be fair. And besides, you've never even seen me pitch. Oh. Gee, Mr. Kim, you sure know a lot. But I should have remembered that. People who look like you are always smart. Audrey, you're doing it again. What's that? Stereotyping. But I said something nice about Mr. Kim. But Audrey, you can't know what I'm like just because I'm Korean American. You need to get to know me first before you can decide whether I'm smart or not. So. There are some people who look like you who aren't smart? Of course, there are all kinds of Korean Americans, just like there are all kinds of Jewish people, or African American people, or Irish people, or any people. Oh, 
so Korean Americans aren't all good at math. <laughs> of course not. I used to get so mad when I was growing up. Everyone used to think that I loved math and science just because I'm Asian American. Well, didn't you? I like them all right, but not as much as I love sports, and especially baseball. That's why I became a gym teacher. I used to hate it when people kept pushing me into math and science. But why? I think it would be great if people thought I was smart because of how I looked. My feelings wouldn't have been hurt if Audrey thought I was a good baseball player. My feelings were hurt because she thought I was a bad baseball player. Are you sure that's the only reason your feelings were hurt? You know why I hated to have people always think that I was good at math? Why? Because it made me feel like they weren't really seeing me. It made me feel like I wasn't a person. Yeah, that is how I felt. Audrey, when you told me I couldn't play baseball, I, I felt like I was invisible. And I'm not. I guess I wasn't seeing you. I guess I was just seeing those other kids who looked like you. Audrey, I thought you were going to come pitch some balls. I will, Catalion, and maybe Arthur wants to practice his hitting. Arthur? Um, Audrey, can I talk to you for a minute? Privately? Sure, Catalion. Excuse me, Arthur, excuse me, Mr. Kim. Audrey, I know you think that kids who look like me aren't supposed to know things, but didn't you say that Arthur couldn't play baseball because of, uh, you know, those other kids who look like him? Um... <sighs> I made a mistake, Catalion. I know it's hard to believe, but even captains can make mistakes sometimes. Just because people look alike on the outside, doesn't mean that they're the same on the inside. Yeah, and that means that kids who look like me can know as much as kids who look like you. I know, Catalion. At least now I know. So, does that mean Arthur is a good baseball player? I don't know, but I do know that I can't tell by what he looks like. Hey, Arthur, come on, come on, let's play ball. Cool. Can you come out and play too? Absolutely, I've got my mitt ready. And Mr. Kim, I still think you're smart. Not because you're a Korean American, but because you helped me. Oh, thanks, Arthur. And now let's all play ball. <laughs>